Prince William is done with Harry as Endgame was the final straw for brothers. Prince William is said to be done with Prince Harry after the royal racist row is being discussed again, according to reports. Prince William is reportedly done with Prince Harry after the reignition of the royal racism row. Welcome to Royal Pancakes. Please don't forget to subscribe and click the notifications bell, so you don't miss any updates about the British royal family. Two senior royals who allegedly voiced concerns over the skin color of Harry and Meghan's son Archie were named in the Dutch version of Omid Scobie's controversial book, Endgame. A source close to the royal camp told the Mirror, it's a bit of a final straw now. Prince William has had enough. It's about enough as a big brother can take. He was starting to come round to the idea of trying to mend their rift but at this moment, Wills is done. A family friend added, they are tired of the drama. Dragging Kate into it was unnecessary. It's gone too far. This echoes the view of a royal expert who recently said Prince William will be furious that Kate has been dragged into the racism row. Charles and Kate were named as the royals who allegedly had concerns about how dark the skin of Prince Harry and Meghan's son might be before he was born. This claim was published in the Dutch version of Omid's book, which was quickly removed from sale after this revelation, not found in the English edition. Ingrid Seward, a royal expert, told the Mirror, there is no doubt Prince William will be furious about the latest supposed slur against his wife. He will be angry at the media for giving the story such massive exposure. He will be angry with Harry and Meghan regardless of whether they were involved or not. He will be angry with himself for allowing Catherine's name to be involved as he is very protective of her. William has a big temper, but he is also kind and sympathetic. He will use this to comfort his princess should she need it. But Catherine is not a Middleton for nothing. She is strong and has grown stronger over the years of being inside the royal family. She has had two. They all do. As it is an unwritten rule to ignore the unpleasant and often untrue things said about them. Otherwise, they would not be able to function. The shocking claims were first aired during Harry and Meghan's bombshell interview with Oprah Winfrey in 2021, but the couple didn't reveal who was involved. The Sussex's explosive revelations sparked a nationwide debate about potential racial bias within the royal family. In today's multicultural Britain, such accusations against the monarchy stirred up public discussion, a conversation that author Omid Scobie's new book aims to contribute to. Omid has dismissed any blame for the mistake in the Dutch translation of his book. In the UK edition of Endgame, he doesn't disclose who was implicated in the racism scandal. He admitted knowing who they are but stated laws in the United Kingdom prevent me from reporting who they were. Chatting on Dutch talk show Artie Boulevard, Omid explained, the book is in several languages, and unfortunately I do not speak Dutch. But if there are translation errors, I'm sure the publishers will have it under control. I wrote and edited the English version. There's never been no version I've produced which has names in it. He further denied ever writing the names, asserting, there's never been no version I've produced which has names in it. He also confirms that Meghan and Harry didn't participate in writing Endgame. Speaking to The Standard, he said, there's enough people around them and in their orbit who know the ins and outs of things.